Of course, the human face is pivotal to interpersonal communication. I mean, the face is seemingly one of the most expressive parts of the human body. In fact, there's all kinds of micro-expressions that the face can do. There's these subtle cues that we can give that give people an insight into our minds. I mean, you might say that our face is the closest thing to turning our minds inside out. It's a way to glimpse the interiority of another person. You can literally read someone's face and glimpse their inner state. Of course, some people are more expressive than others. What's interesting about how we process faces is that it's a part of the brain called the fusiform gyrus that does what's called holistic perception. And so we take in a lot of different cues, a lot of different elements that we perceive, and then we create kind of a larger whole. We render a composite of what we're interpreting or perceiving in that moment. We tend to be attracted to symmetry, and you know, there's all these elements of like the golden ratio and how they apply to faces, we seem to be primed and looking for genetic health in terms of what we're attracted to that seems to be on display in people's faces, which is absolutely fascinating. This episode is surely going to blow your mind, so keep your face tuned to the TV.